All right, so now we're going to look at um, the difference between margins and padding in the CSS. So the key difference is that margins put space between elements, whereas padding puts a space within an element. So I'm going to explain that by um, defining some padding for some elements here on this page. All right, so to make this more noticeable, we're going to need to change this up a bit. So I'm going to put in a div here. And we'll have that div contain this entire first set of, of materials. We'll close the div. Oop. And then I'm going to give this a class. We'll just call it opening div. OK. All right, so now we have this div element that holds this, uh, this content. So now I'm going to go to my style sheet. <clears throat> Note already that that's already a link there. I'm going to create a style link to that. So that was a class. So we'll start with the dot. Thing. Div. Is that right? Yep. Okay. And now I'm going to set a background color just so we can see it. Uh, let's see, we'll change this to, that uh, doesn't really matter. We'll do this dark olive green. Okay, so there we go. Uh-oh, something happened there. Let me see what happened. Oh. There we go. <laughs> All right, so we have that. So now let's apply some padding to this. So we're going to go back to the style sheet. Well, let's first off, we'll start off with the margin. So I'm going to do um, margin, and we'll do a margin of um, 40 pixels. Oh, I need to put in break there. So note that, put the space outside of the div. See the blue extent there. I'm going to turn on, well, let's, let me turn on the developer's tools real quick. Have a look at that. So this is going to be kind of tiny. <clears throat> okay, so let's look at, let's do an inspect. That's that object. There's the whole div. And you can see the margin here is set to 40 pixels. So I'm going to turn that off. You can see then the margin disappears. Okay. Pull this back over. Okay, so now I'm going to swap that out for padding. All right, so note now that this uh, padding is within the element or within the div. So now this extra space that's in green, again, is within the element as opposed to outside of it. And again, if we open up our developer tools, let's do an inspect, and there's the padding, which we can remove. So in, in short, that's the difference. Margin puts space outside of the element, whereas uh, whereas padding puts it within the element. Note also that you can specify paddings for specific dimensions. So I'm going to get rid of this and, and also margins. And we'll set this to, we'll do padding top. And we'll set that to, let's do 100 pixels. So that's 100 pixels, the top, padding bottom. We'll do 50 pixels. So 50 pixels at the bottom. And then padding left. Do 
uh, let's see, 25 pixels and adding right do 70 pixels. Okay, so that's the difference between margin padding and then also how to set different margins and paddings for top, bottom, left, and right.